up, Legacy Legion? This is Jacob Water03 from MorphinLegacy.com, and I am out here again shopping for Beast Morphers toys. Uh, it is a cloudy and cold day here in Denver, but oh, but I am out shopping because I need to find more Beast Morphers toys. So, um, I'm gonna hit a couple targets because I'm looking for the Beast Bots and the Morpher today. So Target is where to go for those. So I'm gonna hit a couple targets. Hopefully I'll look out like I did at Walmart and find them at the first location because that would be great. So let's go inside and see what we can find. Uh, last video you saw that I found the Beast Morphers figures. Those are at Walmart. So I'm gonna go try to, again, I'm gonna try to find the Beast Bots and the Morpher. So um, let's go. Now, well we know what you're all about. Alright everyone, I'm finally home. Welcome back to my dead channel. Just kidding. Um, okay, so I bought a few things at Target. It was a little bit of a weird experience at Target. Uh, there were some people following me around after I was recording, so I thought they'd think I was stole stealing, I think, <laughs> which is really weird. Anyways, uh, I love Target, so I didn't shoplift, because that's, yeah, don't do that. Uh, so I bought what you saw in the video. I bought a, um, I bought a Smash uh, Beast Bot figure. Yes. And I also got a Cruise Beast Bot figure. Check that out. Ooh, snazzy. Um, I also found the Beast X Morpher that is here. Got that too. Um, I noticed that next to the Power Ranger toys, there was stuff, stuff I didn't buy. So I didn't buy the masks. I didn't buy the Thin Man figures, as I like to call them, because I don't like those. They're weird. So I don't buy those. Um, but there were masks, and there were those, I think they're 12-inch, 12 12-inch 12 figures there, too. So if you wanted to buy those, you can. Those are there. Um, I also bought a Micro Morpher Zord. I bought one, just to see how it was. I don't, I don't know if I want to buy any more yet. I just wanted to see what one was like. So I had bought one Micromorpher Zord. Um, and then they also had the Micromorpher figures there too. So there were a bunch of those. I bought three. So we're going to do a live unboxing, unwrapping, whatever opening of those. So I'll have three of those and then the Micromorpher Zord. So we'll talk about that in a minute. So let's talk about, um, let's talk about the uh, packaging like I always do. So let's talk, let's start with the, uh, uh, Beast Bot figures. So here is again the Cruise figure. Um, let's switch to the side, shall we? So standard Beast Morphers packaging, just like the figures that we got before. Um, here, this one also comes with a Cruise key, and same packaging as before. It's just a little different. Cruise is a little cooler because he can transform into the motorcycle mode, so that makes him a little cooler than the other figures. These are $14.99. The price is a little more... It makes sense for him. I'm not sure if it makes sense for Smash or even for Jax. I'm not sure if Jax will be worth $15, so hopefully that price will go down. So, yeah. Um, hopefully that does go down, because I don't know if I want to pay that much for Jax. So, I mean, I, I still will, but... Okay, so, <laughs> and check out the back packaging. There's the back. 
case you wanted to see that. Um, not much to talk about there. This one has the uh, Beast Bots and some of the Rangers on the side. And here's the Cruise packaging. Pretty much the same. This, this one, obviously, it has the Beast Bots on the corners instead of the Rangers, so that's cool. Love that. And then here's the back of the, the uh, Smash Box. Smash Box! Smash also comes with the key, too, so... What's gonna be cool now is that now that I have the Morpher, I can try out the key. So we're gonna try that at some point during the video too. So check that out in a second. Um, here is the Beast X Morpher. This is a little different kind of packaging. It's open. I mean, I guess the other Morphers were open too, but that's, people have been talking about that. I don't know why people have been talking about that, that the packaging is open. Is that a weird thing to you? I, I don't know, but I, I think it's pretty cool. So we got Devin on the cover here, the Red Ranger reacts to voice sound and motion it's morphin time and power rangers is go time so we got the kids on the back very nice packaging look at the side Ooh, that's snazzy and then here we got some more on this side too looks just as sweet the top it's almost too nice to open <laughs> i mean of course i'm gonna open it but it's almost too nice and this one comes with a little uh thing with a bunch of what they call that? I don't know what they call that, but they have with a bunch of keys on it. So we're gonna open that and we're gonna test out the Morpher and we're gonna give you a little review of the figures too and tell you what I think. So let's open the figures first of the Beast Bots and then I will tell you what I think about those. Okay, so here is the Cruise action figure in its motorcycle mode. So this actually looks pretty cool in its little mode. I like it like this. Um, it was a little complicated to try to figure out how to do it. Uh, those instructions are always really confusing. Even if they try to make it simple, it's still really confusing. So the, it comes in three pieces. Here is the little, a little. I guess he has a little cannon that shoots out at you. Look. Sweet. Um, so then here, it's a little easier to explain it to you if I just do it. So here, take it off like this. Take off this little part because this is one of the pieces that comes and it kind of snaps under here. So, <laughs> wait, well, it snapped in when I did it before. Hold on. Okay, so as you saw, I had to cut away and I had to calm myself down. <laughs> I'm a little frustrated. I was trying to do this backwards for you. I was gonna show you the, the cycle first and then I was gonna transform him back in, into Cruz. However, putting this little thing in here, there was like a little snap. It goes and it clicks in there. I, for the life of me, cannot get this out. I'm, I'm trying to like say, hey, this is the cruise figure. Let's talk about it. I cannot do it. I can't get this out. For so I can't take it out with a butter knife. I can't take it out with my fingers. I don't, I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Is there a release? Am I missing something? What? I don't know. I, I can't do it. I think I'm stupid. So <laughs> I am, you saw the cycle mode at least. <laughs> so you're just gonna have to see him with his with the with that attached to his head because there's no way I can talk about it. I can't take it off. So, um, <laughs> the plastic is really cheap on these. It's bad. I don't like this at all. I hate it. Uh, probably my first disappointment from Hasbro. Uh, it's really cheap. Um, uh, for fourteen ninety nine. The okay. So smash or Cruz's arms move up and down they don't bend or anything like that his legs do but that's so that he can go into the motorcycle mode and um i even like the tires and stuff they look like tires from like the really shitty bandai ones that we used to get like the cycles that didn't have anything to do with the show that's what it reminds me of it's just not that great so i don't really care for that um the, the some things are pretty cool like i do like his face his face is pretty cool if i think that they kind of went with the gimmick too much because they're like hey let's make him into a motorcycle that's awesome because he does that in the show so let's do it 
but it's really just terrible. I hate this. Uh, but see, it's but it's super easy to transform him back into the motorcycle. Or it's supposed to be easy. Again, I'm I must be stupid. I must be stupid. There. Well, that's how it's supposed to generally be. So I'm gonna have to keep mine in the cycle mode because I, for some reason, am not able to take that pin out. Uh, if I can, I'm gonna re-edit this video maybe and tra cha change it up. But this, just the cycle mode, I guess. Keep I, I have to keep it in the cycle mode because I can't take it out unless I snap completely snap the plastic off. I can't take it off. So I'm not sure if anyone else had that problem or if it's just me being stupid or uh, I'm gonna consult with some other toy people and see. So, but I'm gonna move on because. Again, I don't like this. Uh, $14.99, dude. I mean, I just came off of a high from the figures for nine forty eight or whatever at Walmart. Great price, and they were really cool, and they looked great. This is, quality is really awful. I don't like it. It's cheap. Very, very cheap for $14.99. Very cheap. I think that they skimmed hardcore on this part and went with the figure part. So, um... That's my view on Cruz. So let's move on to Smash. Okay, so let's talk about Smash. Not so happy with Cruz, but I am a little happier with Smash. Um, I was gonna say in the beginning and before I actually got this toy, I'm not, I wasn't looking at pictures and seeing things that I was too happy with the silver. I mean, you can see that his silver is pretty good on the feet, but then the silver on the chest and the fist are this really dull looking gray color, which I don't like, don't like that. Um, that's really my only complaint so far though. So I opened it, it's a solid figure, cause he's big, I guess. So he's not a transforming figure, so I didn't have any issues with that. Um, some people didn't really like his fists because they were orange and, and they shoot out. Oh, <laughs> shot my phone. <laughs> Anyways, there we go. Okay, that's, that's pretty cool, I like that. So he's got punt fists that fly out at you and I liked that, so he's pretty solid. He's a pretty solid figure. Um, arms move up and down and they bend at the elbow so that's good I like this because he, his little head spins and his head turns and stuff too so and he they also gave you this little shield that goes on his arm that looks like his sword isn't that cool okay so that I liked so I really do like smash and I I, I was honestly thinking it was gonna be the opposite so I again I don't know what I did wrong with Cruz I might have screwed it up but Again, this is not a non-transforming toy, so he actually is really cool. So I am on board with with Cru with Smash, but not with Cruz. Um, again, my only complaint was this silver part. That's not silver; it's gray. That's really my only complaint. Everything else is really cute. He's pretty standard. Pretty. This is what I want for fourteen ninety nine. I get that that Cruz is a smaller figure and he was transformable, but that didn't work out for me. Uh, it just didn't. But I do like Smash. So, um, let's move on to the Morpher and try out some keys. Okay, so here is the Beast X Morpher. Played with it a little bit before I decided to show you, so it's actually really fun. Um, lots of sounds and stuff to do. Um, so obviously, you've seen it before. Press it, and it pops up just like in the Go Buster Morpher. That pops up. But let's turn it on, duh. <laughs> duh. Let's go! Rangers, it's go time! Unleash the beasts! It's morphin' time! It's morphin' time! Alright, so let's press this red button here. Are you ready? Say, it's morphin' time! It's morphin' time! Alright, so that was fun. <laughs> that was fun. Okay, so let's put this this little guy let's put the visor down. Uh so I'm a little confused about the Valcro, but I'm confused about a lot of stuff today, so who the hell knows? So here's the morpher. Obviously it does that. Yeah, so that's really cool. I really like that. Um, 
let's get into the keys. So I had a bunch of keys from the figures that I bought and then the Beast Bots came with figu or, uh, keys. So let's try a few. So here is the Red Ranger's key from the Red Ranger action figure. This is weird, how they go in here. Um, uh, I got one stuck in there a minute ago, so I'm really dumb. So just put it in there and then press Let's it. Let's go for a spin, Cruz. Yeah. Cheetah beast power, red. Rangers, it's go time. Let's go. So I think that's all he says. <laughs> Unleash the beast. Right, so that's red key. Try the yellow key. Jackrabbit beast power, yellow. You messed with the wrong ranger. Oh uh, yeah. Jackrabbit beast power, yellow. So I guess that's yellow. All right, here is blue, the ranger's key. Oh, see. Nice to see you, rangers. Did I unlock a phrase? I, I jacked it up. Wait, it's stuck in there again. Out. Oh, there we go. All right, hold on. There we go. <laughs> blue ranger power. Okay. Okay, so it looks like it says maybe two original phrases per, or ish phrases per key. Here's the Tronic key. Tronics attack! The Morph X is mine! Tronics attack! Not today, Rangers! They got a couple of those villain sounds. Um, I think there was another one. I feel like there was another one. Tronics attack! I thought there was another one, guess not. So let's try the blaze key. I'm not a real human. I'm much better. I'm the better Red Ranger. I'm not a real human. I'm much better. Not today, Rangers. I'm the better Red Ranger. I have to spin this thing. Is mine. I don't know if that, not a that real does human. anything. I'm much better. I'm not sure if that actually does anything. Um, here is the smash key. If I can get it in there. There we go. Let's smash this! Blue Ranger, you're so brave! Aww. Let's smash this! So that, I guess that's what smash says. Here is what Cruz's key says. Moto mode activated! Let's take a spin in the Racer Sword! Moto mode activated. Rangers, it's go time. And then, of course, it came with the little dangle here, or doggle, or whatever, dongle, whatever you call it. Here's what the green key does. Oh, look, jacked it up again. There we go. Wait. I'm not a real human. I'm much better. Oh, we heard those. I'm the better Red Ranger. I'm not a real human. I'm much better. Not today, Rangers. I heard another Scrozzle one earlier. I'm the better Red Ranger. The Morph X is mine! I'm not a real human. I'm much better. Not today, Rangers! Or maybe I didn't. Let's try the gold key. Defenders of the grid! That I like. It's morphin' time! Let's go! Cheetah beast power! Red! Let's go for a spin, Cruz! Looks like that one's just a bunch of samples and stuff, but I could have sworn I heard another scrozzle sound when I put in the green key earlier. Maybe I'm gonna let's try it again. Okay. I'm not a real human, I'm much better. I'm the better Red Ranger. I'm not a real human, I'm I guess much not. better. <laughs> but it is really cool. It was um $39.99, but it is worth it for the lights and sounds how long has it been since we had morphers with lights and sounds well we've had morphers with sounds obviously but this one actually has lights and motion activated stuff so it like, changes colors yeah see it changes colors it pops up has things that pop up on it it's actually fairly comparable to the go buster morpher oh it's morphin time <laughs> So the Beast X Morpher from Hasbro is approved by Jay. Uh, <laughs> okay. 
Okay, so I don't really have any really complaints about the beast the beast sticks morpher. Um, there's nothing really to complain about. It was pretty. It's nice. It's got like the great lights and sounds. It's got a bunch of sounds. I'm assuming that more sounds are coming with the different keys. Um, I know we still have the the uh, Jack's key that's coming, and I'm assuming there's a more villain keys and stuff like that. So we're gonna be unlocking new sounds and stuff. So that's gonna be fun. It's always fun to unlock new sounds and stuff in the morphers. Um, you know, like whatever. But so that's always fun. So um, let's get into some fun unboxing, unwrapping stuff. So again, like I told you, I bought the Micro Morpher blind bags at Target as well. Those were $3.99? Yeah, $3.99. So I have three of those. It says there's two in here. So what that means? Times two? X two? I'm hoping that's what it means. So let's let's open one, find out what let's find out. Get this easy. It was very easy to open. Alright, sweet. And yes, there are two. Yay! I got a Rita. My life is complete. And I got a little Kimberly. Look how tiny she is. <laughs> they're so tiny. Oh my God, they're so cute. Okay, let's set these over here. You can't, well, okay, get out of the, get out of the frame, Kimberly. All right, that was blind bag number one. Let's try second one. I, I think for $3.99, that's pretty cool that there's two figures in there. Wasn't expecting that. Okay, so my second one that I opened, I got a little Tronic. He's a little Tronic. Cute. Cute, cute. And a little, what is it? Who is this? What is this? Oh, it's a little Zeo Blue Ranger. I wasn't expecting that. Huh. Love a Zeo Blue Ranger. All right, let's get to the last one. Oh, it's already the last one. Okay, so... That is the Red Ranger. I thought that was Blaze for a second, but that is the Red Ranger. And I got a second Rita. So which one of my friends is going to get the second Rita? Hmm, I wonder. <laughs> All right, and I also, those are fun. I love those. Uh, I love that there's two figures in them. They're super cute. I mean, they're not really, like, highly painted or anything, but, of course, they're just fun. They're cute. They're cute little figures, and I like those. I have a bunch of them. I call them the Chibi figures. I have a bunch of them up there, too, so... Okay, so I also bought a uh, Micromorpher Zord. I think I've only seen pictures of these. I don't really know specifically what they are. I, I don't remember, really. So let's open it and find out. All right, so there's a bunch of these semi-open at Target, too. So I think people are doing that. Oh, pretty. Look at this. All right, look. It comes in, like, this acid green bag. That's fun. All right, let's... That's fun. <laughs> all right, so, okay, see, I'm like, I'm new with this. I don't know what these are. Uh, all right, so look, we got some stickers here. Got some action stickers, a lightning bolt, and some other shit. Uh, oh, okay, it looks like it's like a Megazord. So, like, this is Cheetah, the Cheetah. There's a bunch of stickers for the Cheetah, see? All right, let's see what I got here. Let's see what this is. Is it like a little Zord Bay? Like, how do you open? Is this an open? Does it open? Oh, it opens. Watching Jay fumble with toys. Okay, so it opens. Oh, and there's like a little gate. Look, there's a little gate in the front. <laughs> I don't know what that is, but I, okay. And, okay, so when you open it, there's like two little more bags in there. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, work. Like, there's an... There's littler bags inside. Yep. <sighs> Gonna have to get scissors. Okay, so there was two little bags up top. Let's open that. What is it? Let's see. Oh, so I think they're a little more, they're more micromorphers. So look, here is the, I got another Red Ranger, but he's in a different pose now. Here's the one I got before. And now here's the one that came in the Zord. So he's in a different pose this time for the Zord. Let's put him over there. So let's see what else I got in this. And it looks like little pieces. Little pieces. Okay. I'm going to have to open the instructions because I don't really know what, this, what these are, kind of. 
So, okay, right here, more pieces here. There's more. They come in, they come stuffed in there. Oh. It's like a thing. Oh, look it. Okay, that's what you do. <laughs> this, this is what you do. There. Is it like a little display? Oh, it's like a little display. Oh, I see. Okay. Oh, and I broke it. I broke it already. Great. Great job, Jay. I broke it. Well, there's a little door. I think I broke it. I didn't break it, did I? Oh my god. Great. I broke it already. All right, but let's get to that, whatever that is. Whatever these are. There's more stuff in there. I can get these out. Oh, there's another door. <laughs> there's another door right here. I'm like, how do you get this out? Oh, there's another door. Okay, so there's a couple things in there. I didn't, I almost broke, I think I broke this door. But that, there's like, a, there's two little doors and they're, they're hidden. That's kind of cool. I really like that. This is rando. Okay, so let's open, I think there's another chibi figure in here. Let's open this. My scissors are not cutting anything right now. What is this? Oh, it's a monster, but he's like acid green. Okay, we haven't seen that monster yet. It looks like a dumbbell monster. I haven't seen that yet. But he's cute. It's clear. Transparent. Translucent. All right, so let's open this. I think this is more effects. I don't know what these are. Are these effects? Yeah, see, I got more of these. What are these? Um, I'm going to pause the video so that I can maybe... Is there instructions? Like, what is this? Do I... <laughs> don't do it. I'm like, am I just dumb? What up? Oh, wait. Is that on the box? Like, how do you do this? What is this? The only thing I could think is that maybe it fits into his little fist here. As a sword, maybe? Or like weapons? For the little Megazord guy? Is it like a gun? Or something? That's the only thing I can think of that this is. Because that's the only place it fits is inside the little fist. But then when you pull the little garage door open, look. Not the garage. But they, they have little pegs, so you can put them on display. That is really cool. Okay, these were six ninety nine. That was really cool. For You get two figures, just like you do in the blind bags. And then you get this little, this cute little display piece. And it actually has two pegs on each floor, so you could put even more of them on there. So yeah, that's actually cute for the price peg, for the price point, and for being able just to do that. I think that's great. I like those. So, very worth the thing, the price. Uh, so, I guess the only thing I didn't really like was Smash, uh, not Smash, Cruise. Uh, where is he? I... I don't know what to do with this. Uh, I'm gonna try some more to try to change his mode and see if I can get that part out. Maybe I'm doing something wrong again, I don't know. Um, I really enjoyed Smash. Great, great figure, I liked it a lot. Uh, only complaint again was the silver up here, but what are you gonna do? Uh, the Morpher, fabulous, loved it. Great for the price, $39.99. So get that when you can. Um, and then I highly recommend the Micromorphers and the Micromorphers Zords. Those are really fun. Uh, again, three ninety nine for the two figures inside the blind bags, and then six ninety nine for the actual little Megazord. So that's my little review of these figures uh, and my little unboxing that I just did. <laughs> again, I had a little problem with Cruz, but uh, you know you always have your problems. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Like. Um, you did the other one. I hope you enjoyed the other one anyways. Uh, I decided to do a second one because I felt maybe I should. <laughs> so uh, make sure that you like and subscribe. And I'll comment, comment down below because I want to hear what you think. And maybe if you had that same problem with with uh, Cruz. I don't know if I was the only one. Uh, I don't know if I'm dumb. Tell me what figures you got in your uh, Micromorphers. Yeah, Micromorphers. I almost call it something different. Tell me what figures you got. So tell me in the comments. I want to hear what you think. And then again, the lightning collection video will be coming probably at the end of the month. So I'm excited to get those. That's what I really want to get. Um, and I think I'm going to buy more of those Micromorpher packs because those are really fun. So going to get more of those for sure. So pretty happy so so far with Hasbro. I Just not with Cruz. That's the only thing I'm not happy with at all. So I um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to follow Morphin Legacy everywhere on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and here on YouTube. And uh, don't forget that we do have a podcast here on morphinlegacy.com. It's called The Grid. We 
And so uh, go to morphinlegacy.com if you want more information on our podcast. So we're going to be talking about that. I'm going to be mentioning lots of other stuff. So uh, follow us everywhere. And uh, all right. So thanks for going on this journey a second time with me. And then, like I said, the third video will be lightning collection figures. I'm excited for that. All right. So thanks again for watching. Bye.